Arthur on BBS is one amazing show. It's one of the longest running children's cartoons of all time. But there was one time BBS accidentally aired an episode that was never supposed to be aired in DVD. It only aired once. It didn't repeat later on that day either like Arthur usually does. This episode was extremely scary since had blood and gore in it. This episode alone scared the kids for a life who watched this episode. Parents flooded BPS with complaints that this episode scared their kids to death with all the content in it. Very few people remember it, and it never got to go on YouTube due to copyright reasons. If you managed to tape this episode when it aired, consider yourself lucky. But whatever you do, don't post it on YouTube or your account will be suspended due to a copyright claim from BPS. The story goes that I was at the Goodwill store. I was scrolling through the VHS tapes and found a few Arthur tapes. One of them had a faded cover of another Arthur VHS release. In Sharpie it was labeled as Fransky. So was the actual tape. So I bought it $1.99. I went home and got out the VCR that I haven't used in 10 years. I dusted it and the tape. The tape started with contributions from your BPS from viewers like you. Thank you. Just like the show normally does. The intro plays like normal, but at the end, when BW says hey, Arthur falls and the screen turns black. The episode begins with very odd animation that you would see in an Richard Scarry's Golden Books video. Francine's dad and her decide to go on a camping trip to a cabin in the woods. After they pack all their equipment, they go to Francine's grandpa's house to get supplies. They arrive at the woods. They are looking for the cabin but can't find it. They finally found it, but it turns out to be a house. An old big house. They go inside and there is no electricity. So they brought candles and flashlights just in case. They turn them on and they see a message in the wall written in blood. Get out of here. So they look around some more and they find camp equipment that has been left behind by the previous visitors. They go upstairs and find paintings in the hallways disappear right before their eyes. Later on, it turns out to be the dead people in the playroom that were portraits. They go to an abandoned playroom and find a lullaby playing. So they look to see a bunch of dismembered body parts with blood soaked into the floor. One of the head's eyes turn red and Francine and her father are teleported into an intestine-like path leading into a slipped ball that reflects their faces. A ghostly voice says, Play with me. The ghost appears and it's actually Francine with a blank face. So the ghost kills Francine's dad by impaling him with her hands and beheading him. She teleports his head with the other beheaded heads. She says, Francine runs away she the ghost chases her. Francine trips in an ultrasound-like tube. The sound immobilizes the ghost and becomes even more deadly, as she transforms into what Francine's fetus looked like, while she was in the womb of her mom. Francine steps in the ultrasound again and a seizure-inducing background appears. Francine gets possessed by the background that she becomes the ghost. Now, when Francine's sister and mother followed her and her dad, she lures them into the room to show the beheaded head of her dad. Then it happens all over again. The rest of the episode is the seizure including background that goes on for 10 minutes. The episode also gave a small number of kids seizures and were rushed to the hospital. I got the tape out of the VCR, threw it out and never saw it again. But someone may have the lost episode somewhere. We will never know, unless someone uploads it on YouTube. The end.